So, Jimmy, every time we share a story about skydiving, you have the exact same response. So, remind our viewers what that response is. Why would anybody jump out of a perfectly good airplane? <laughs> See what I mean? Mm. Knowing that, we had to bring our next guest in so you could ask him that. A little background, he's simulating what it would feel like to jump out of a plane. He's not actually jumping out of a perfectly good airplane for fun. What he's doing though, however, he's winning medal after medal while he's doing it. No, oh, yeah, he's only 12. 12. Hmm. 12. We'd like to introduce you to Chase Dolan and the man who has helped turn Chase into the world-class athlete. He is Coach Harry Burning. So what we are talking about is tunnel diving. What is it, Chase? Um, it's just it's a whole bunch of wind just mm -hmm. going up <laughs> into a tunnel. <laughs> and there's enough wind to push you up mm -hmm. to simulate right. skydiving. Okay. Or so you're not jumping out of an airplane. Mm -hmm. So it's like you're flying inside the tunnel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How did you get started in something like this? Uh, my parents own a skydiving business. Yeah. Skydiving OC, and they wanted me to jump, but obviously I can't because I'm not old enough. So they wanted me to feel what it was like to do it. So they signed me up for that. And I've just been doing it ever since. So this is a fairly new sport, isn't it, Harry? Um, it's been it's been going on for for a little bit, mm -hmm. um, but uh, in recent days now, it's definitely been taking a lot more traction, getting a lot more uh, of notice, so to speak. But it's been happening for a little while now. Oh, okay. You've been close to the family. You've you've worked with them. I um, well, strangely enough, eight years ago, I did my very first skydive, and it happened to be down here in Ocean City, Maryland. Yeah. And uh, um, the the DZO, the drop zone owner of the airport, uh, Josh, happened to be my skydiving uh, tandem instructor who kind of took me through the ropes in the beginning and uh, I just went out to go try and skydive and see what it felt like and uh, kind of see what the rush was all about. And then afterwards, I ended up getting really just wanted to go back up again and I started getting licensed and got my instructor rating. Um, not here in Ocean City, a different airport. Okay. But then uh, eight years later, I um, happened to be an indoor skydiving tunnel instructor and um, I'm running the kids club there and then through the door walks Chase and, uh, and the parents who own the drop zone, Chase's parents. And, um, and so just strangely enough, they took me on my first skydive and eight years later now I'm coaching their son in the tunnel. How about how to that? Fly. So yeah, small world. Huh? So, so what do you have to do to become a coach in uh, tunnel diving? So with, as far as flying inside the, the wind tunnel and being an instructor, it doesn't require any type of uh, skydiving beforehand of an airplane. But I, um, I had been a skydiving instructor for quite a, quite a while uh, as a skydiving coach. And, um, and then after I'd been doing that for a few years, uh, I got the job working at, uh, as an instructor at the wind tunnel. Yeah. So. This is some amazing video here. Chase, tell me, what does this feel like when you do this? Um, it feels like you're flying, pretty much. Yeah? Which is what it looks like. Is this you here? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's me coaching uh, Chase. This was actually this last week. Oh. Chase is getting his uh, sit flying. That's what we call sit flying right there. Wow. And you brought some gear along with you. Can you tell us what we have here? This is my helmet. Mm-hmm. In which you need the visor so the wind doesn't go into your eyes. Right. That's blind. important. Okay, and then you have special clothes that you have to wear? Yeah, that's for the aerodynamics, I guess, so it's easier to press up and do right. all the movements. Yeah, and it gives you consistency as well wearing a, a jumpsuit okay. all the time, so. Is, is this, a, can, you can compete doing this? Yeah, this is a competitive sport. What's that? Yeah, you gotta show that one, Chase. is my medal that I won Last week, two weeks ago? Two weeks ago. Wow. They, had the, they had the Nationals indoor, indoor tunnel competition at Virginia Beach, and Chase, uh, Chase and his, uh, his partner came in, um, in second, got silver place, so. So tell me, how did they cool. judge? Very cool. how, <laughs> what, what is the difference between a good athlete in this sport and, and one that needs some work? I mean, yeah. what are they judging? Um, so there's different categories in a, in a wind tunnel competition. There are outdoor skydiving competitions as well, but as far as the tunnel goes, uh, the different categories is dynamic flying, which is almost like an aerial dance choreograph, so to speak. There's different maneuvers, mm -hmm. and uh, you are given a set of maneuvers that you have to perform. Judges kind of grade you on how quickly you can do those maneuvers. Now, as far as Chase was doing, they were doing he was doing belly flying with another partner of his, and they had to make a formation, and as soon as they break that formation, the clock starts, and then they have to do as many formations that the judge give them beforehand yeah. within 35 seconds of each other and then they have six rounds between each round they have to go and re rehearse a whole new dive flow go back into this partner do as many as they can in 35 seconds jump out relearn it 
go back into a different formation, dive for another 35 seconds. So, wow. very, yeah, it was very grueling. I was feeling worn out just watching these guys <laughs> flying and, and going through the whole motions and stuff, but I'm pretty proud of them. They did an awesome job. So. Is, this, is it hard? It's very good. Um, for a person who's never done it, it's very yeah. difficult. <laughs> are there certain uh, movements that are harder than others or ones that it's taken you uh, a long time to master? Um, yeah. Kind of formations, mm -hmm. I guess, yeah. So let me ask you this. I mean, obviously, you're very good at this. Obviously, you're very good at this. Would you jump out of a plane? Yes. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Same for the <laughs> no fear. Open the Seems door. Fun. Let me out. I want to go. <laughs> wow. How about that? What would you tell other people uh, who might express an interest in this? Um, it's fun. It's fun. Yeah, yeah. it's fun. I think it's something else. It looks like fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's worth the trouble. It's worth the time. Mm -hmm. It's worth the effort. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Man. All right, Chase. Well, congratulations. Yeah. Do we get to learn how to do this? I, I'll, I'll go. Yeah. Okay. Why not? <laughs> Chase. Thank, thank you, you so much, Harry. Thank you for coming in. Thank you guys so Wonderful. much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And if you would like to read more about Chase's accomplishments or tunnel diving or even how to give it your, a try yourself, mm -hmm. just head over to our website, domarvelife.com.